Well, new at 11 tonight, an incredible story from the South Bay. Yeah, imagine what you might have been doing at the age of 14, maybe riding your bicycle, going to band practice, maybe checking out the new movie with your friends. Well, sounds about right. But tonight, ABC 7 News South Bay reporter Lauren Martinez met one 14 year old graduating college and now going to work for SpaceX. I'm graduating with a degree in computer science and engineering from Santa Clara University. Bay Area native Kyron Quasi is 14 years old. On June 17th, he will become the youngest graduate in the history of Santa Clara University. If you ask him, he'll say he's had a fairly normal college experience. There wasn't anything to compare it to say, oh, this is different. But I really enjoyed it. I made a lot of really close friends. I think after a few days, the novelty of me being there wore off. His parents say he was speaking in full sentences at two years old. During third grade, um, it became very obvious to my teachers, my parents, and my pediatrician that mainstream education wasn't the right path for my um, accelerated learning ability. Not only was his IQ seen as profoundly gifted, so was his emotional intelligence. Quasi started at Las Positas Community College when he was nine years old and transferred to SCU when he was 11. I went from being like a third grade mutineer to really feeling validated intellectually. By the time he transferred to SCU, he had already started working with Intel Labs as the only undergraduate intern on on his team. Quasi is grateful leaders gave him opportunities to see beyond his age. I think there's a conventional mindset that I'm missing out on childhood, um, but I don't think that's true. I think, again, that mindset would have me graduating middle school now. Quasi can't drive or see an R rated movie, but starting next month, he'll be working full time as a software engineer for SpaceX. On Tuesday, Santa Clara City Council congratulated the young mastermind for his past achievements and his future ones. I would also like to compliment like institutions like SpaceX and Intel, which took basically exceptional out of the box steps to make sure this thing happened. Quasi will be moving to Washington State with his mom as he joins SpaceX's Starlink team. My journey wouldn't have been possible if for if not for influential people in positions of power. Um, again, looking beyond my age, but I would say my mom. In Santa Clara, Lauren Martinez, ABC 7 News.